can a Christian be possessed with demons? The answer is no. A Christian cannot be possessed with demons. The reason is because of the very character of the administration of eternal life. That eternal life demands that you are joined to Christ. And the Bible says, he that is joined to Christ is one spirit. But this is the balance. Just because a Christian cannot be possessed does not mean Satan does not have an activity that a believer can be a victim of. The first two that I listed, witchcraft and manipulation and control, it does not matter how born again that believer is. The cure for witchcraft and the cure for manipulation and control is not just being born again. It's putting on the whole armor of God. I will teach you that one. Are you seeing now? There are many, many believers that are saved and yet will be victims of this. Why? Ephesians 4, 18. Having their understanding darkened. Not having their salvation lost. Having their understanding darkened. Being alienated from the life of God through the ignorance that is in them because of the blindness of their heart. A Christian cannot be possessed, but he can be demonized, manipulated, and controlled at the solical realm. Absolutely. Here is where we need to balance in the body of Christ. And most of you know that I love the body of Christ. I'm sent to the body of Christ. But let us not give the devil the authorization to prey on our ignorance. Satan came to Jesus, holy Jesus, righteous Jesus, blameless Jesus. He came to him, spoke with him. He took, it is written. It did not take Jesus being the word to be saved. It didn't take Jesus being born of the word to be saved from that deception. It took him having knowledge and replying back. It is written and get thee behind me. Two things that saved Jesus. It is written and get thee behind me understanding of scripture and understanding of authority are we learning now so the whole idea that just because you are saved automatically satan has nothing to do with your life it's a lie it's not true i can tell you by the authority of scripture it is not true the disciples the apostles they continue to tell you how that Satan would come and attempt to challenge them, challenge their minds, challenge their body, and they continue to stand with the operation of the word of God. When Jesus entered the temple and preached and rebuked spirits, the people did not show any evidence that they had any spirit at work in them. It was when he gave the command. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Three levels of satanic influences. Witchcraft through deception, manipulation and control, largely in the realm of your mind, and then complete possession, influencing your spirit, influencing your mind, and influencing your body. Now, having put down all of